My granddaughter has been lost to us. I would have her return to me post haste. And you, sir, I am told, are the man to do the job. At my age, I mean, I've been doing this since I was 15, so it's been 43 years now of, of, of filmmaking. And it's my age, my job at 57, and it gets harder to do the older you get, is to stay interested. Because if I'm not interested, the audience is going to be interested. So to, for me to stay interested, I have to pick and choose and be eclectic in my genre choices and eclectic in the kinds of characters I play. And I'm very blessed that I got to make a movie with Michael uh, Pig. You know, I call him Archangel Michael. I, I always knew that, that it would take a young filmmaker with a new vision who maybe saw some of my movies growing up to kind of rediscover me. And I was waiting for him to show up and then he did. And I think the fact that I could do something with Michael that was more of a quiet meditative haiku and then go smash cut, I mean, literally back to back to this Western kabuki, you know, operatic style of filmmaking and performance, I'm very happy. And you know, when I did Pig, I was still kind of recovering from my leg injury. I had a broken leg and you know, I'd put on a lot of weight and I was saying to Michael, I'm terrified because I gotta go get in this little tight leather one piece suit for prisoners. How am I gonna get this weight off? And I, he put me on a keto diet. He, he once again helped me. I mean, I wasn't quite where I wanted to be for pr prisoners but it was better than where I was. Um, but a lot of it had to do with, um, all of it had to do with trying to give Sono his, his vision, you know, that was the job for me. Just how can I, how can I facilitate your vision?